Look how cute that is. I like these ones. Yeah, they're cute. Oh, that's just too cute. Um, we went, we're here to get um, Christmas lights, but we're getting distracted by all the other Christmas decorations and stuff. So, yeah, that's the thing. I think these top it off. These are really nice. Look. Oh, those are cool. Fifteen dollars for four giant glasses. Nice. Hey guys, so I got a couple more Christmas cards in the mail today, and I got another postcard. Um, this one is from Taiwan, um, <clears throat> and it's, it's this, and, um, and I don't, I don't know where that bridge is or what, but, um, yeah, it's really cool. It's in Taiwan, obviously, um, and the guy that sent me this, his name is Juan, I, although I don't know how you'd say that in whatever language they speak in Taiwan, but, um, yeah, he's in college studying social work, and, um, he wrote my name in Chinese, which that's what it is, and then he sa said, good luck for you, good luck for you in Chinese, and, um, yeah, anyway, um, this is what he sent me, which is really awesome. Then I got a Christmas card from my cousins Ray and Wanda. Well, they're my second or second or third cousins, I don't remember. And um very pretty. And inside they said, "Hope you two are doing well. Our best wishes to the family." Um Nancy and Emily which Nancy is my mom's name. Um, wishing you a very Merry Christmas and may your new year be filled with every joy and happiness. Love you, Ray and Wanda. And then they put this cute little sticker that says his, his coming has brought, has brought you the, I can't even read through the camera. His coming has brought the joy that lasts and lasts um they're very religious so yeah i just love this it's really pretty i got another card from um let's see who is it from my friend crystal lang um which i met her through the paranormal research society and she sent me this card and it's really pretty um and on the inside it says it has this pretty little cute Christmas tree, and it says, Wishing you a Christmas filled with joy and special moments. And um, this made me laugh, but it made me smile, and I love it. Love your Parasis. Um, I just thought that was funny. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, I don't know if you can tell, but um, I got Christmas lights, and um, I finally got Christmas lights, which they I only got a 50-foot... We went to Sam's, and um, they had fifty a 50-foot light LED lights, and there's 200 lights on it, and it was $20, which was awesome. Um, I wanted to get, we, well, we got two strands, one for here, and then one for my aunt's house, so um, yeah, but when I hung this up... I hung up these lights. Um, I was thinking it would be really cool if I had like two strands for like the living room and then maybe one for like the kitchen. I just think it would look really cool, but um I might wait till after Christmas when stuff really goes on sale, like the Christmas decorations and stuff. Um, I'm gonna set aside some money for that. Um, I should be getting another YouTube check soon, so we'll see. Um, that and if I get another job soon. Oh, I didn't mention, um, I forgot to, this kind of dropped off, um, my thinking plane. But, um, I did let go of that job that I had, um, 
I'm in the process of looking for a um, psychologist and um, yeah I I mean I do um, yeah. how should I put this um, I don't necessarily regret letting go of the job per se more it's more so of I kind of feel I in a way I kind of feel like I've failed myself um in not being able to do something so simple as talking on the phone um for front for a theater fundraiser or for a fundraising campaign for a theater. Um, most people don't think about talking on the phone as that much of a big deal, but um, I don't remember if I've said this before, but it literally can take me up to 20 minutes before I'm able to pick up, a f pick up the phone and call somebody. Um, Granted, there are some calls that are easier for me to make than others, but, um, yeah, I don't know. Like, I can, I can easily make a call to, I can easily send or receive a call from my mom, a few family members, um, my dentist, who I've been going to for, like, 12 years now, um, I've been going to the same dentist for like 12 years. Um, and a couple of friends, you know. I mean, so there's about maybe like 15 people that I don't really have an issue picking up the phone for because I talk to them on the phone on a regular basis or I've been talking to them I've been talking to them for years. So Excuse me, um, but other people who, it just, I don't know. I can't explain it. It's just, I don't know. Um, anyway, I mean, I'm still looking for another job. <laughs> but yeah, anyway, um, oh, I also forgot. Um, <clears throat> I got this book called Myths and Mysteries of Florida by, um, E. Lynn Wright. Um, I'll put er, I'll put the name of the title of this in the description. Um, I've read the first chapter, which is um, the elusive Florida skunk ape, or Sasquatch, or Bigfoot, or the Yeti. Um, yeah, that's the first chapter, and I read that, and it's really good so far. Um, but yeah, anyway. I got that. I have stuff I need to ship and I need to get boxes for these um, Christmas presents that I made for some people. And I, we also got these cute little snowmen. Um, they're like piggy banks and there's cookies inside of them. I'm going to give them to a couple of my little cousins. Um, but I thought I'd just put them there for now, um, until Christmas, because I just think they're really cute. Um, I got those at Sam's. It was, like, $10 for both of those. Um, but there's cookies inside of them, and they're piggy banks, and they're cute. Um, so, I don't know why I'm doing this. Um, anyway, um, oh, and I put a little... I love how my camera just automatically stops recording at 10 minutes. I put my little Christmas tree there, and then I attached it to the lights, which I think looks really good. Um, I would like to do them all in the, at least in this room in the dining area, but dirty clothes. Um, but yeah, like I said, I'm gonna wait till after the holidays before I buy any other holiday decorations until they go on sale. Um, I did add some Christmas decorations to my wish list on Amazon, but um, nobody ever sends me anything from there anyway. 
which, you know, whatever. It's more of, hey, when I have the money for this, I have it saved, so I know where to find it. But, um, yeah, anyway, um, I, I also do keep, I always put, um, my Amazon wish list in the description, but, um, yeah, anyway, um, I'm gonna go, and I will see you all tomorrow. Bye.